Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, this time we are going full version from the sword of the highest damage, as we can see here. Almost 3k or 1 billion, that was on Goliath, and as Polar Bear from Andy Relo's Discord was telling me that Goliath's armor is much lower than any like other enemies that we are having in the game, so that's why they are taking more damage, but they have a lot of more health so i don't know if that was just a lucky shot because i have not been able to that much even with the crits yet we are getting close we are getting thousand over thousand close to thousand sometimes even near two thousand but that 3k melee damage was just truly amazing also no i'm not playing on the easiest on level scaling off i'm playing on easier and default why default just because i am too lazy to go into the settings, setting up every day to default to nightmares because I really want to play smoothly and get my quests at the first time so that's why I'm playing on default. As you have already noticed I'm using only one weapon and I don't know what's up with that one because I'm trying, I have been trying to equip another weapon but it just seems to make it worse so with only one weapon I am able to do this with other weapons I don't know if that is just luck or something but my damage is actually getting lower when I am using another weapons of course your best bet of doing really high damage is always on stunned enemy from behind and if you are getting crit that is even better I think it is time to move on to the build itself so done done Da here we go our first gear piece will be Torscape with three plus four armor runes we are not getting any perks from Torch set but we are getting the set perk from the next item that is Charlemagne's torso so we are getting two set bonus from this one add some of your armor to your stun when equipped we are having a square rune of increased armor when stunning on an enemy and two plus five armor runes on this one. By the way, you can get Torscape just playing the game and the Solomon pieces I'm using in this one you can get from the Helix store or at Reda at some point. Moving on to the bow, we are having Shadow Strike. This bow you can actually get from the Helix store or from Reda. This is standalone weapons or bows, so this is not part of any set. I have critical damage runes on this one and increase attack after every hit and the perk from this weapon increase critical damage when close to full health our only melee weapon is passive sword increase attack when parrying increase speed after dodge i am having weird runes on this one restore some health on parry and two speed runes on our head we are having Charlemagne's crown so we are feeling like the king so the same armor to stun bonus with top of that 3 plus 5 armor runes. The two last items from this build, the Elderman, Bracers and Trousers, we are getting increased stun after a kill, 2 set bonus perk on the Bracers, I'm having 3 plus 5 runes to our armor, on the Trousers I'm having 2 plus 5 armor and 1 hybrid rune with 11 health and 4 armor. As you can see we are power level 469 so this was before the new 1.4.1 update and no I don't see any reasons why this build would be any different than before the update so definitely use it and if you do let me know how much damage you were able to do and what was your best damage in the comments down below quick heads up there is gonna be one minor change on this build coming up but here we are having over 800 damage and it was not even a crit Oh my goodness, 1194 damage without critting, so that is unbelievable. Alright, so what was changed? Only one rune on the weapon, on the Basim sword, we are having increased heavy damage after each light hit up to 6 times, instead of the health on parry rune. After testing there was only little changes on the damage, and we are not gonna dive too deep on the failed attempts of doing really really high damage I just want to wish you at this point Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays before we are rolling the outro
thanks for watching remember to hit the like hit the sub turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that i upload or when i go live also vikings have fun stay safe be strong hope to see you in the next one skatha over and up and bye bye